Hello Libra, this is your messages for May 4th through May 11th, 2024. I don't DM or solicit, and if you want to book a reading with me, you can do it right in my Etsy shop. I go as low as $10. So we have a lot of interesting information in this reading. We have a lot of interesting energy. We have Jupiter and Taurus, which is all about expansion and opportunities and big growth and luck and building upon foundations. We also have Pluto retrograde, which is, which is really all about kind of like purging and transformation and life-altering experiences and intense energy and big transformations and endings and new beginnings and karmic debt and releasing the past. So what do we have for you? What do we need to know here? Wow, we have death and rebirth. Look at that image. That is powerful. Darkness to light. So I feel like you're going to be diving into your darkness, like your shadow side. Like I feel like you're going to be getting into that. Like you might be doing a shadow work journal or you might buy a book on shadow work or, you know, you might want to start journaling or really just kind of like diving into it. You might even be doing therapy or trauma therapy. There's something there. There is an unhealed trauma. And I feel like it's long standing, and I feel like it's this is like long overdue. So if you're called to do this, it's like this is definitely what yes, your soul wants you to do this. Um, what I see is, and what I feel most is, is that it's all about change. Whatever's going on in your life, this is an indicator that it can't stay that way anymore. It's not balanced. So whether it's with work and money or work and home or work and home and money or work and family or family and money, there's an imbalance somewhere and it's causing you a lot of like emotional detriment. It's like you're, you're, you, you've already like been through the motions, I feel like with this person or situation and it's very draining and taxing on your soul. So it's like you're meant to maybe end a connection or relationship or you are meant to move on or see it for what it is and accept it and not try to change it anymore. There's something with that. It's just like, I feel like your perception has been blurred. I feel like you have had like distractions like you're not able to really just like discern the way you want to, but I feel like, you know, you will be having that energy around you supporting you for like letting go if that's what you need or want to do with something and also like whatever might be or feel very karmic to you. You might be dealing with a karmic relationship or a karmic connection and it doesn't have to be romantic. It could be somebody in your family. It could be a friend, but I feel like a change is going to present itself. Like it's going to come and you're going to see it and you're going to have to make the decision and it's hard for you because Libra, of course, is not the best at decisions, but there's going to be a deeper message. There's going to be something you see. There's going to be something that leads you to the way you need to go. Like, look, she knows the way she needs to go. And it's really you parting with this trauma or this darkness and being on your way to healing. Your affirmation is, I turn to my eternal soul for power and direction because my soul is wise and I fearlessly face the future. Love and light.